What up, DTZ viewers? Yeah, we up in this thing early this morning. You know, 11 o'clock is early for me. You know, I'm heading out. Go ahead and get the car um, hopefully cleaned up a little bit because the weather is nice today. You know, for a couple of days now, it's been the weather's been kind of kind of cool out here. You know, it's kind of hard to keep your car clean here in Memphis, anyway. So, yeah, it's kind of hard, man. But I had to get on up, try something different today. Try to get out a little bit, clean it up. Probably vacuum it out too, cause. Man, ooh, I'm about to give my baby some attention. You know I have to give it some attention. <laughs> yes, I do, man. On this beautiful Sunday. Yeah, we out here on a beautiful Sunday, man. I can't believe people can just sleep there all night, man, right in front of a building. You know, that's, that's kind of hard, man. You can sleep out here on a building all night, dude. I don't know if I can pull that one off right there. Ooh I think, man, I gotta have a mattress or something. You know, I, I wanna do something. I wanna be able to do something to help the homeless people. Cause I know, you know, there's a lot of things been going on where, where the homeless people been, you know, people don't really trust a lot of homeless people these days because they think they're just doing it for a job. Yeah, some of them are. And then some of them, boy, they really, really in bad shape like that. And they really need help. I know it's hard to figure out who's who, but some kind of way we got to figure it out. I don't know. Maybe we have to monitor these people. If we monitor them, then we'll know who we're dealing with. You know, because you want to know who you're dealing with anyway. Yeah. I just want to put myself in a position where I can maybe, you know, give some donation to the, to the homeless people. Kind of get them off the street for a couple of days or whatever. Give, I don't, I don't know what they do with the money. I don't know if they're going to actually take the money and go get a room to, to stay in overnight to get out of the weather conditions, or if they're going to, you know, do some personal things with it. Maybe get something to drink. But I don't know. But I'm like this, man. Once I give you the money, you can do whatever you want to do with it because you're grown. You know, I can't tell you how to live your life. You know. Take the horses to the water, but you can't make them drink. It's up to the horse whether the horse wants to drink the water or not. Man, I'm about to go do a little shaving. And clean up a little bit. And I'm going to get this car washed. Yeah, I'll probably... Basically what I do, man, when I call a wash, this is what I do. It ain't like I just go get a soap bucket and try to soap the whole darn car up, you know. I don't, I don't even do stuff like that. I don't even try to soap the whole car up, man. No, not me. I ain't trying to soap my whole car up. I do it the easy way, baby. Maybe every now and then I'll probably wax it, you know. Put that wax on there, that cleaner wax. Yeah, baby. Put the cleaner wax on there. We'll see. We'll see. Stay tuned.
And that's where the trick comes in. When you put that towel on it, oh baby, everything falls right into place there. Right in the place, just like I would want it to. So, little slope here, slope there. I want to see if that bird's going to come over here. Now. Looks like the bird's going to come over here. I see a lot of people out house painting. Painting the house. I stick with the car. Maybe I'll put a paint job on this, this thing. Who knows? I know I gotta get, gotta get, um, take it to the shop. Let to take a couple dents out for me. On this side. So I do want this side back in top shape, back in top condition. Car was sitting up. So I had to get a key made. And that's when people just started, just started running into it for some reason. Like, whoa! They're tying my baby up! Okay. I get it fixed. Put everything back in, in its perspective. It look nice. That only makes me come out even harder. Wanna tie my stuff up? Okay. All right, it might cost me a little money, but it'll make me come out even harder. Look at it anyway. We don't want to put a lot of, don't want to add a lot of soap to that, as you can see. Want to get it. Little soap, little soap as possible. And that soap I use, the less soap I use, the better it'll be. Turn it on the soap. It's all about that soap though. And that stuff to dry on there and mix the weather. Mix got that, you know, mix got that funny weather, man. Like cold one day and hot the next, so you never know how to treat the car. Yeah. You never know, you never know what type of treatment you put on your car. Just like that. Hopefully, you're using the right treatment. Right. That's all it takes to wash the car, man. When you've been doing it for so long, like you said, it's gonna take a lot. Yeah. Let y'all check out my wipe down technique. <laughs> Significant technique. Take this towel, baby. All, all the way around. All the way around. All the way. Bingo! That's where. That's the job, baby. How you do it? How you do it? Normally I get the top first, but you know, real life situation. I told you, on the day it's a real life situation. Real life situation. Look at this thing, man. Look at this. See, if you want to dry your car off real quick, get you a towel about this size. I'll show you, man. Get you a towel about this size, man. Get, get the job done. I know a lot of people use those uh, other little thingies. Not me. I don't need one. I like this better. It's smoother. It's a lot smoother. And anything I know. Anything I know. So, like I said, man, tell anybody. I ain't no CJ on 32, but I try to take care of my little ride, man. I suggest you do the same. 
Maybe one day I'll be up there with CJ on 32s and CJ so cool. Well, oh, they're my favorite guys, man. They be out purchasing vehicles. Maybe one day I'll be able to purchase a vehicle. So y'all, some of my purchases, videos. Working. Working at the car wash. Car wash. Come on, help me sing it, y'all. Car wash. Well, well. Working at the car wash. And work. And work. Just gotta work, man. You gotta do it. You gotta do it. You, you, you gotta do it. Let's get down here. Get on this here. Oh man. You gotta be quick, cause sometimes when you wipe people's cars off, uh, you know, they don't wanna be waiting all day on you to wipe the car down. Cause they may have somewhere to go. But when you're doing your own car like this, you can take your time. You can take your time and get all the little necessary areas that you wouldn't normally get. You don't want to miss too much. Not too much. You don't want to miss too much. Hopefully we'll get the end off in a little bit. Yeah, yeah. We'll get the end resolved in a little bit. Get to the top with that. To the top. Get the top and hit it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do Yeah, one day I hope to be. Hope one day I'd like to be like my YouTubers. My pioneers of YouTube. I don't know about the 32. <laughs> that might be a little too high for me right there, boy. I have to get a ladder. I have to get a ladder just to get in and out the car on them 32s. That might be a little work, man. Like you said. Those are show, show, those are show cars, so those are show cars. You don't ride everybody in a show car. But this is not a show car, unfortunately. I ride everybody in this car. This is just a regular car. Don't want to be clean these days. And let me clean you, man. Wanna be clean? Never know what we might get into tonight. Making all that noise. Huh? You hear me, Cole? Yes, I hear you on the day. Alright. Let me know you hear me. Oh, now we're going to the top. Are we going? To the top. I don't worry about the inside today. I don't think I'm going to worry about the inside today. I do know that much. And that going to get in there. He's going to mess it up again anyway. What's the point?
making noise, dog. I do the inside. I'll show it to you, but you know, this is what we got in the finish. Uh huh. This is the finish. The finishing. I gotta get this side uh, fixed. That's why I gotta get the dent pulled out. But you know, no problem. We'll get that done, baby. We'll get this baby back on the road. Get it back on. The road. Sure will. Huh? It's a little dirty. Well, it's not a little dirty. <laughs> it's a lot dirty on the inside. A lot dirty. I still got this camera on the tripod, so it ain't gonna be the best of viewing. It ain't gonna be the best, baby. She knows. It is what it is, man. Ain't the best. But it is what it is. So you have it, guys. That's how Uncle Dave washed his car. And that's basically how I take this towel. I mean, this size towel. Man, you wipe the whole car down in no time. Just that easy, baby. See you next time.